Welcome back. Well, perhaps you've watched news stories about tragedies in other countries and wondered how you can help. When a Victoria nurse decided to put those thoughts into action, working overseas with Samaritan's Purse. Veronica Cooper has the story. I remember walking around our field hospital thinking this is exactly where I want to be right now. Just one year into her nursing career, Catherine Hensman joined Samaritan's Purse in Ecuador after the 2016 earthquake. We deployed to a city called Chone, where their hospital had been completely demolished by the earthquake. And so while they had medical staff, they didn't have anywhere for the medical staff to work. Samaritan's Purse provides aid to victims of war and disaster. Most people have heard of them because they run Operation Christmas Child, where they collect shoeboxes and ship them to needy people overseas. I work on a disaster assistance response team that deploys to disasters internationally and provides medical aid and food and supplies and shelter. At 25, Catherine has been on four missions, including two to Iraq. She was 20 kilometers from an active war zone. We would hear the bombs in the morning and in the afternoon our patients would come with injuries from those bombing attacks. So she has a real heart for patients and she learns unusual things rapidly. I think she, she, she learns faster than any other nurse that I've ever met. We got 650,000 Rohingya people that have had to flee and they've come here. Her most recent deployment was to Bangladesh, treating refugees from Myanmar. They're living in refugee camps that are overcrowded and definitely lacking in resources. Catherine also nurses in Victoria. I work at the Royal Jubilee Hospital. I kind of just show up for a few weeks at a time and work there, and then I go overseas again. Because for Catherine, it's a calling. I think for anybody who reads news stories and looks at them and says, I just want to go and I want to do something about that, that they absolutely should if they can, because it's the most rewarding work to me that I've ever done in my life. Vital People is brought to you in part by the Victoria Foundation, connecting people who care with causes that matter.